You've tried statins, you've changed your diet, but your cholesterol is still too high. What now? Well, it turns out there's a relatively new treatment that could change everything for the many people who struggle with this situation. I'm Dr. Simin Lee, a cardiologist helping women take control of their heart health. Some of my patients have had adverse reactions to statins or just need more help lowering their LDL cholesterol and their heart disease risk than what their statin can offer. In my practice, there's been a relatively new cholesterol medication that has been very helpful in these exact situations, PCSK9 inhibitors. PCSK9 inhibitors are kind of like the GLP-1s of cholesterol. They're relatively new, but still underused and under-discussed injectable medications that work totally differently from statins to lower cholesterol. This is exactly how they work. PCSK9 is an enzyme that reduces your body's ability to clear LDL or the bad cholesterol. PCSK9 inhibitors block this enzyme, allowing your liver to remove more LDL from the bloodstream. The result, these medications lower LDL by 50 to 70%, even in people already on statins. The most well-known PCSK9 inhibitors are alirocumab or pralulant and evolocumab or repatha. Who should consider PCSK9 inhibitors? As I mentioned before, for me, I bring up these medications as an option for my patients to consider in a few key scenarios. Number one, people with extremely high cholesterol to the point that it seems genetic, which we call familial hypercholesterolemia. Number two, people with a history of heart attacks or strokes who just can't seem to reach their LDL goal on a statin alone. And finally, people who just can't tolerate statins. How well do they work? Two large, exceptionally well done clinical trials published in a leading medical journal help guide us here. The Fourier trial found that evolocumab lowered LDL by 59% and reduced major heart events by 15%. The Odyssey Outcomes trial found that alirocumab reduced major heart events by 15% and lowered all-cause mortality, death from any cause as well. So what does this mean for you? PCSK9 inhibitors are changing the way we manage high cholesterol, especially for people who are at high risk of heart disease. We know that this topic, cholesterol, can be very difficult and very personal, and it honestly just doesn't get the time it deserves in a typical doctor's visit. If you're struggling with high cholesterol, if you want to talk through options, I personally would love to help. You can book a free consult call with me through the link in my bio, and otherwise just follow along to keep learning more about heart health.